Well, I can remember chasing him up the beach when I was about five years old or even, even younger at the Coca-Cola Classic in Manly. So uh, <laughs> it, it, it's just a pretty bizarre thing to think that he's still you know, at the top of this sport. We've had a few heats over the years um, and then you know I, I had a heat with him at Bells a couple of years ago and he got the better of me there and then he beat me in Portugal again the same year. Well having Kelly in a heat for, for me is one of the best things ever just he's been one of my heroes forever when I was growing up and you know now I'm competing on the world tour it's uh, one of the hardest things I had to deal with last year was competing against my heroes and this year, it's, it's, it's definitely you know, right there in my face, surfing against Kelly and be happy to do it. You know, I, Owen, he's definitely keeping me honest. You know, I gotta stay on my toes. And you know, now, obviously, he's super confident, one of the most confident guys in the world. He's got a huge bag of tricks. He's good in all different waves. And you know, he really wants it. I think you can see he really loves competing and, and um, he loves pushing himself against the best guys and, and um, you know I love the same thing and, and um, you know maybe it's, maybe it's fitting that he's coming into his career and I'm, I'm probably finishing mine. Having Kelly in three consecutive finals is, is for me a dream come true. Like I don't know if anyone else has had that opportunity to have it three times in a row and it's been a pretty big learning curve. Tahiti, I felt like I just needed to catch one more wave and then I kind of adjusted a few things and um, really came out with a fresh drive from New York and, and then in New York was just, yeah, just really hit the final with everything I had and really didn't want to lose to him a second time in a row but then I had kind of no idea that I'd be in the final against him, you know, the very next week. So for me it was pretty hard to come straight off that win and, and go straight back into the first round to the next contest with the, that win being my first World Tour win. So uh, it was, you know, it was, it was a building scale for me throughout the Trestles event and I, I finally I got to the final and I didn't quite have enough steam left in the tank and Kelly kind of got, got there on, on his last wave. I think for all of us it's a pretty exciting time. Um, I know we'd all really love to see Andy here still um, battling it out with everyone and you know he, he was a kind of guy who really pushed like he didn't back down from any challenge for anybody anywhere and um, you know Owen's kind of that same thing a, a different approach but um, definitely has that uh, you know let's do this attitude. Oh